Oscar nominee and Emmy winner Leslie Caron was the original lease in the film An American in Paris, and now the dance and screen legend has seen the hit Broadway musical for herself. We're here at the Palace Theatre to talk with Caron and the show's cast. This production of An American in Paris is so beautifully done. It won four Tony Awards, was nominated for Best Musical. What did you love most about the show when you saw it? I love the conception and I love the dancing, the choreography. I thought was brilliant. I was so thrilled to hear my beloved Gershwin music again. I was very impressed that those remarkable dancers can also sing. What part about this show still gives you chills every time you do it, sir? The music. Uh, I've danced to Gershwin before at New York City Ballet. Um, I've always loved dancing to his music. But this has become just a huge love affair. Uh, I never thought that you could listen to a piece of music over and over again, night after night after night, and not get sick of it. This is the first time everything has come together, where I've loved the music I'm singing, the Gershwin is so incredible, where the, the show looks spectacular and is so beautiful, and audiences come, and not only do they come, they enjoy it. And you've had the opportunity now for a week to hang out with Leslie Karen, the original star. How has that experience been for you and for all of you? It's been kind of surreal and uh, totally unexpected. I mean, I, I've i admired her work for so long. I know she's a legend, but I didn't really know when I met her how touched and moved and inspired I would be. To hear her stories of how she got the job, how Jean Kelly plucked her out of the corps de ballet and she got taken to Hollywood within three days and made a movie and then she made Gigi and then she made Daddy Long Legs and she danced with Gene Kelly, Fred Astaire, all these that made, to hear all these stories, I feel like she's really um, one of the only living people that knew that era of Hollywood. We've been deeply inspired by her. And it, it felt like er, when we first met her and when she came to see our show that night, it was an energy that, you know how they say history repeats itself? Well, we were there creating the history, repeating itself with the history there. She's just so amazing. Like, I'm kind of speechless about it. She's like, one of the coolest people I think I've ever, ever met. She's a huge part of the reason why we're here doing this show. Her and Jean Kelly made this incredible movie together. And, um, you know, I think about it, and she must be the only uh, person who did the movie who's, seen, who's able to see the show. Let's talk about Christopher Wheeldon's Tony Award winning choreography. You're one of the greatest dancers, and you've danced with so many greats, Fred Astaire and Gene Kelly. What did you admire most about Wheeldon's choreography in this show? He really is an inventor. You think everything's been done, everything's been invented. No, when he comes along, you have new gestures, new developments. Uh, it's uh, really quite remarkable. Those people who come to Broadway to see shows who haven't seen An American in Paris yet, why should they do so as soon as they can? Well, I mean, if you love Broadway musicals, there's, it's impossible not to love this. Valentine's Day is coming up, and I cannot think of a more romantic way to spend Valentine's Day than to see our show that is literally bursting with love and beauty and joy. If you're choosing between a trip to Paris and a trip to New York, come to New York and see an American in Paris and you get two for one. <laughs> you get the best of both worlds. A little corner of Paris within Times Square.